The other day, I watched the hit DC movie, Black Adam. It's, it's a brand new movie that I assume is really great. And I say assume because I, I clearly have some memory problems. And that's why after watching this movie, I ran to the hospital and I said, Hey doctor, I just watched the new hit DC movie, Black Adam. And th there's clearly something wrong with my memory because they introduced so many things and I can't remember them ever using them. Like, they're, they're like the rock, he can only be hurt by Eternum. And we learned that in the beginning of the movie. And then they just never use Eternum to hurt him again. And that doesn't make any sense. So clearly there's something wrong with my memory. And then there's just all this other stuff that I can't even remember. Because my memory is so bad. And, and after I watched the movie, I got really, really angry for no reason. I don't know why, because this is such an amazing movie. And I... And I I broke my, my 10 Skyrim disc. I broke my pewter Skyrim dragon. I yelled at my cats. And I, I just fell onto the ground. And I cried and I cried. And I was really angry at, 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 the, at the stupid kid in the movie. Who was clearly written... This, who was clearly written for a 90s script about how cool skateboarding is. How radical it is. And I don't know why I was so angry. So I said, Doctor, what's wrong with me? Please help me. And the doctor said, Don't worry, there's nothing wrong with your memory. And your reaction to that movie is perfectly normal. Because the new DC hit movie, Black Adam, is the worst movie ever made. It's total garbage and you shouldn't have seen it. That'll be $10,000. And then I ran home and I, and I made this video. I just got back from the hospital and I had to make the video about how how it turns out that Black Adam is such a bad movie that I literally thought there was something wrong with my brain and I couldn't remember anything. So if you watch Black Adam, just remember that's just the way the movie is made. That's not you. It's not it's the movie's fault for making you think you have serious mental problems.